Hi guys, so today we are going to be vaccinating our chickens. Remember, vaccination is one of those things that we need to do and it's a must, no matter how many you have. So today we have bought a 1000 dose vaccine for Coriza. Um, as you can see, this is our dose for our Coriza. So we are going to be vaccinating against Coriza. And the first thing when you buy a vaccine is to read instructions. Um, this one, it's uh, to be stored 4 to 10 uh, degrees Celsius. As you can see, uh, it was in, this was cold ice. We have put it in cold ice. And then also, uh, you have to inject 0.5 mils per, per every bed. So please make sure it's 0.5 mils, not 5 mils. And this is uh, 500 mils. But we have uh, a few chickens, even not more than 100. But vaccination is a must. So we're going to be showing you how we're going to be vaccinating these chickens. So um, uh, guys, follow me as we're going to start. So here I have my vaccine. I have my syringe here. Um, it's a 2 millimeter syringe. As you can see, it's a 2 millimeter syringe. So 0 0.5 per every bed. So I can fill my 2 millimeter syringe. And this one can vaccinate uh, up to up to four uh, beds. So make sure it's 0 0.5 millimeters not five millimeters and then after that so this ring is actually very um very good for you and then i have a withdrawal syringe this one a withdrawal syringe that is the one that i'm going to use to to get uh, the vaccine and i also have my this one is the needle that i'm going to use uh to be vaccinated as you can see it's quite small you don't have to use uh, those are uh, bigger that that big string because you'll be playing on the breast uh, of, of your chicken. So let's start I right, so like this is my string and um, I'm going to take this my need to and I'm going to take my string over here. This is my string And then I'm going to shake it And then you open this upper part you place your needle and then you get your vaccine so in place so that you don't leave many holes on the um, on your container you can now remove and then you take this smaller one you place it So this one, uh, she's a Jubilee Opington. Hi Jubilee. This one, um, Golden Lace Opington. So just make sure you do it on the breast. This one is a blue open turn. Oh, okay. This one, that's a bath open turn. Okay, Buffy. Again, so when you have someone to be helping you, they'll be just drink the swingies, and then um, you you have to to be only injecting. So make sure that your vaccine it stays also in in cold water. And from here, remember our video when we did the Taiwanian pack. So after this, we are also going to be vaccinating some of the chicken that are in one pack. Uh, they are over four weeks now. They are over four weeks now. So remember to drink on the breast. Strictly on the breast where they flesh. Sorry. So most of 
most of the chips here we have uh, the blue, the open tones. And the main. Uh oh, she, she, she's actually biting my my string. Already on five weeks. So make sure it's on the breast. Now we are done with this one. Let me go and collect other batch. Now this is our second batch, and uh, we are fascinating it again. This one is always that one again. was the five weeks. So for large batches, if you you can't vaccinate them, you can actually hire experts, and uh, you need this in a an automated way. And um, for for those with smaller batches, you can actually do it. Maybe you you, you combine uh, with other farmers and then you you can vaccinate like uh, for example this vaccine we we are vaccinating this and we are actually going again to to one impact and we'll be, we'll be vaccinating also um another big day in in one impact sorry guys And then, so here I'm vaccinating about uh, 32 beds. And then in one park, I think there are only 10. So I'm vaccinating less than 50 beds, but you have to buy, um, you have to buy the vaccine even if it means you're going to buy uh, a thousand dollars. Then because when it comes, it is going to to destroy your beds. So make sure you prevent. And uh, in terms of effectiveness, you start to see or oh, it becomes effective normally uh from it becomes effective from seven days to ten days that's when the vaccine becomes um effective so you don't have to expose or don't try to expose again in the environment uh, from actually about 10 days that's when your beds can can be safe but after vaccination it doesn't mean that your beds cannot be affected but you have um, high chances for for them to to, to be affected by by the vaccine or to be affected by by, by the virus when it comes so prevention is better than cure and make sure you get the best Always remember it's 0.5 mils, not 5 mils. And it's on the breast, not on the wing. vaccination normally as a rule of thumb we expect that at least 95 percent of your of your beds have been vaccinated so actually even this one it won't uh, actually have a harm but would recommend you to vaccinate but it's actually underweight maybe it's sick so never vaccinate sick beds that's also one thing that you need to to, to remember
done and then we remove and we have to clean it and then let's go to Warren Park and yeah, now in Warren Park you can go in list we are now in Warren Park and uh, remember that video I will leave the link on the um, up there you check on the link in Warren Park so this is some of the flock that we have so we need to vaccinate these ones uh, so you dip on the breast on the breast and then from the syringe you pull it to one And then another bed. So catch them young. Uh -huh. So help in the straight. Help in the munyama time. Exactly. So, so this is intramuscular. Remember to put in the muscle. So we are actually training uh, these young guys uh, so that they are also watching the process and um, they will learn as we we do it so this other flock we have already vaccinated them along back and then uh -huh. mm -hmm. And then we are training them. Exactly. And then you draw. We go pin there. And then what's your Sarah? So we are also teaching them how to do it right, Bo. So guys, uh -huh. so thank you guys for watching Usena uh, Solution. If it's your first time to be on this channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Link on the notification here, and also don't forget to leave a comment, like, and also subscribe. Please, guys, uh, if you need anything that you want to learn in terms of how to vaccinate, next time we're going to cover. Um, Powerpox and also other vaccination programs that we do and then please note that the vaccine should be vaccinated within uh, Two hours so we came from where the other stock was and we already arrived in Warren Park And then we vaccinated all our flock within two hours. So make sure that uh, when once the vaccine is opened and it should be within two hours and uh, if you can check my vaccine here um it's not even a quarter uh, as you can see it's not even a quarter done it's um but you you definitely have to to use it uh you definitely have to vaccinate your your stock again especially for coriza because coriza is one of those diseases that you definitely need to to do away with so bye bye guys next time don't forget to like and share the video